What's your advice to a sister who has been married before marrying a brother with kids? Look at the quality of the brother. If he's a good, righteous brother, he's honest, he's handsome, strong, he's somebody that, that's a good husband for you, bismillah. Matters not whether he has kids or not. You may marry a brother who's single, a brother who's a virgin, a brother who has no kids, and he may be a horrible husband for you. He may be a bad husband, he may not have no money, he may have a weak physical body, he may not be handsome, how you want him to be handsome. What's important is the compatibility between you and him. If the compatibility is strong between you two, strong between you two, and you feel like he's a good match, then look towards the kids. How many kids are there? Ex-wife, do I have the solver to have kids? Do I want to be in that type of blended situation, that blended household? Because marrying someone and they have children is obviously sometimes it's problems. Ex-husband starts tripping. Ex-wife starts bugging out, start fighting, arguing, so on and so forth. Stepchildren treat you like trash. It happens. They don't want to talk to you. No, you're not my dad. You're not my umi. You're not my real dad. Get out of here. What is the situation? All stepchildren are not like that. Many, if not most, are. But not all. Everyone understand this? So look at the situation after you've already affirmed the fact that there's a good deal of attraction, compatibility, and chemistry between what? You and him. Don't exclude the situation if that's there. Wallahu alam.